Hello and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas. If you just really love this enjoy the mad. Now, last time, some fools tried to ambush us by running up to us with a sniper rifle. Yeah, that uh, that is something that did happen. We also took out another one of the named mark people, which is always fun. And we fought an entire bridge full of death claws, which was less fun. But it is something that did occur, so tough to this. Anyway, time to see if there's anything good in this house. Or if all it was was just a place for these bastards to try to ambush me from. By running up to me with a sniper rifle. Like, why? They had great range positions here. Why would they run up to me? Another sniper rifle. Nice. As well as some 308 ammo, which is always a welcome sight. Exceptionally so. We have over 300 now. It probably does help that we got like... 75 primers, I think. Yeah. So I managed to make 75 of those myself. Which does mean we did actually use up some at the point. As sad as that is. Alright, what do we have here? We have the option to recycle some electron charge packs. But a whole lot of them though. Because despite using up multiple ones, you only get a chance to get one back per shot. Not per ammo used. What a shame. Well, we found a silo control station apparently. Industrial hand. Oh yeah, I'm taking that. That looks awesome. It looked like a saw stuck to the thingy. Hey, I did you the order. Eva. I did what now? Where the fuck did it go? I'm quite sure I did not intend to do that one. No. Oh, it blew up me there. Well, honestly, that's good news in this situation because... Good. You're back online. Listen to me, Eddie. If you stay here, they'll dismantle you for parts. You have to go now. I've uploaded destination coordinates for our outpost in Navarro into your system. I want you to go to the Enclave there, okay? Do you understand me? It's gonna be a long journey, my little friend. You'll have to fly very far. And fly very fast. Can you do that? I know you can. Be careful out there, Eddie. Maybe I'll see you again someday. So trying to get all the way to Navarro, isn't that in NCR territory? Yes, it I'm sure it didn't make the entire trip in one go. It's still impressive. We did turn you loose all on your own. That must have been scary. It sounds like it wasn't easy for him either. I bet Whitley would be so pr be, would be proud of him for making it so this far. Come on, we need to get going. Right, and we are at the last level, so... Uh, huh. Well, fine, we can just take this to looking really silly and take this to looking less silly and... Continue? Yeah. And I suppose we'll go for... 
thought you died. I have no idea how much health this will give me, but I know this will give me a lot of health because for every 100 points of karma you gain 10 health. Yeah. Okay. I've lost karma. It looks like the missile hits somewhere on the other side of the divide. You think you could reach location of the blast from Hopesville? That is if you feel brave enough to explore ground zero of a nuclear blast. Where the hell did it land though? I didn't intend to launch a bloody nuke. Alright, see, we can... Wait. Huh, I thought we had more. Than that available to us. Maybe I just can't use that to do the healing. Like maybe if I went with something less instant, I could heal up. All right, let's just wait. I just need to know how much health we got from that. Is it done healing yet? Nope. Well, now it's done healing. And we got to... I suppose we had, uh, like, 900. Yeah. We didn't have it completely maxed out, but it was still pretty, pretty fucking damn impressive. Uh, yep. Okay, now... Where the hell did that go? I really, really did not intend to do that. Oh god damn it, Thunderers! Go away! Shoot! Shoot, I said! I didn't want to see any of you done in nonsense. Huh. I have a severe suspicion I was n I'm not supposed to go down there right now. Let's keep trying. Apparently I need to survive this ride. It's probably supposed to be more difficult to find the addition of these buggers Literally dropping in on me. Which is not fun. Those guys are assholes. Okay. Let's see. I suppose I can't use the steam pack to level up further right. Heal up further right now, man. Come on. There's a cannon. There's a cannon. The choice of this prototype is the fact that I can't deal myself damage with it. That was not a hit. Don't knock me down, please. Because if I get knocked down, I'll probably get killed again. And I don't want to get killed again. Whoop. 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 Come on. Did you just disarm me, you bastard? No. I did get knocked down. But I got up again. And uh, it looks like we are doing fine. I forgot about the fact that I had some auto in check the... Steam packs available to me? Alright, we we'll look good, we'll look good. Maybe I wasn't meant to launch the nuke. But we've done that now and we have no idea where that flew off to. I'm gonna hope it wasn't NCR territory. I really am. To be fair, I also hope it wasn't pulled there too. like I don't want I didn't want to blow anyone up. You know? Just traveling in nicely long, you know. Just doing my own thing. And suddenly a new close up. 
The explosion was me there, I thought, you know, it would be fine. Hmm. That's a launch nuke, alright. Lots of noises around. Hopefully nothing that will try to kill us. Because I really don't want to get killed right now. I desperately don't want to get killed right now. Yeah. I mean, the terminal agrees. What lies behind this door? Oh! Oh yeah! Yes! That's nice. I really don't need that sort of hammer, but... You know... Thanks, CD. Radio. And that looks like... The extent of whatever lied in here. I think the primary function of these locations is to provide the ED upgrades. Yeah. I think that's a sentry bot. Oh, he's frenzied now. Oh hey, blast mastery. I didn't realize that I had Did you really unlock this steering paddle? Right, that's cool. That's cool. And it doesn't have any additional ammo cash even. God damn it. This is what happens when I don't wait for an entire day. Because it had not gone dark yet. Mind you, uh, the autodoc does not heal me to my maximum health. It only to, you know, whatever I can get. Okay, come on. Hello. Can you repair my weapon? Thank you. Oh, it doesn't repair the full. Damn TD, I believed in you. I believed in you, ED. What does this terminal do? Does it construct things? No. Does it consider things? No, of course not. Is the cathedral? Nope. Far from it. No, oh, Lama's replenished. Lisbeth? Uh, nope. Possesses. So the last option was the correct option. Because I literally tried every option. That sometimes does the job, you know? Hello, sir. How are you doing? Just standing around, right? Yeah. Cool. Just make sure no one uh, get, catches me by surprise. Since you're standing guard already, so you might as well. Oh. Come on. No! Why are you so evil, you locks? Um, I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll take that, I'll take that. I still don't know what to do. I should pay more weight. Like, the slightest bit of attention to... Oh, it cues health a little. And actually, that's pretty cool. I can work with that. Hell, I probably won't, but I can. Theoretically. That's an empty supply cabinet, and that is me stuck on a table. And another supply cabinet. So this one already had an empty syringe in it, out of the goods that were actually looking like they would be of any use. Okay, and that's the floor cleared. Nice. To the launch deck. Of course, moving, progressing and whatever would be unnecessarily incomplete without the uh, a couple of nuclear explosions. No, not nuclear in this case, I guess. Seriously, what the fuck did they blow up? Probably wasn't anything good, that's for sure. Right. 
The damage has been great. Full of food. Everyone loves food. And the hard locked box. With absolutely nothing of interest in it. Like. <sighs> yeah, I don't know how. Who does these things and why? Just silly. Just silly. Mind you, the Riot outfit looks really awesome. I think. I haven't actually seen it, but I think it's awesome. You know, because I am allowed to have an idea on what is awesome before actually seeing if it is awesome or not, right? Yeah, that's... That's how hype works, right? So I'm hyped about an outfit in the game. I'm gonna just go for the head. Okay. Not the other head as well. Good thing the tick of damage just came over whenever as soon as it was necessary basically. Just as soon as for me not to get my Dazzle Grim Reaper Sprint thingy. Uh, I'm still annoyed as to how nerf it is in this. I'm gonna assume I have reason to repair my armor. Because I've been through some shit, man. Wait. Big Sexy Sleeper is the way to go to complete these repairs. Thank you, goodbye. Sunstone Tower. Uh, why did I activate Ashton Missiles? Oh, I was supposed to activate the lift, not the whole thing. That makes more sense. Bloody Vendigos. They're not actually Vendigos, probably. Hello, what's here? It's Magnum Rounds, a doctor's bags, and nothing of use. Such excitement. That's actually something in here. Do you bring more monies? Nice. More auto inject bobby sleep bags even? Bobby pins? No. Auto inject bobby pin. That sounds really unhealthy. I would not recommend an auto inject bobby pin. Oh you have an empty syringe. Nice. I'm gonna have to leave. You just wait there, okay? Did you have any additional syringes, maybe? No. Just a butter knife. Not quite as handy. No, it's good to have ED being an extremely clumsy stealthy thingy. So everyone goes for him and I stay in stealth while I pick out everyone attacking ED. At least from time to time, that does work. I love that one occurrence still when I was just knocked back into stealth. Oakville, High Road, Ashton, tiny cracks in the earth, nothing compared to the road carved ahead. Before you, this is the edge of the divide. Ahead lies your work, the history you burned in the earth, what you brought to the people here. I can't see anything, it's dark. It's unnecessarily dark. I can only see these uh, sappy things. What happened here? You delivered a package, had markings that matched those in the divide. Not all. But enough. Military markings from some place the bear had savaged in the west. Maybe seeing those markings on it reminded you of home. Made you carry it. You said it brought it from the west? It was a device. A detonator. One I'd never seen before. Or heard before. You carried that thing to the divide. I know because I followed you as you walked the road. Watched you do 
it. You brought it here, to the community you built. And you are responsible for what happened after, when the device opened, started to speak. When it did, the divide answered back. Those missiles you've seen, buried in their silos. They exploded beneath the ground, cracked the landscape. Sand, ash, the dead. The divide skies became a graveyard. If you saw this happen, then how did you survive? Should have died there. But now that I know you live, the machines here saved me. I was the only survivor. Or thought I was. Your package, the message inside, awoke medical machines, close to the one that shadows you, began to build themselves, then others. They only take what parts they find in the divide, never roam beyond it. Can't even leave the silos without a human to shadow. Like hounds. Maybe they saw the flag on my jacket, thought I was of America. If so, history saved me. A sign. The pa this package, you said it had a marking? Markings even? What was it? Machinery. Simple on the outside. Computer parts. Inside. More complicated. Was the only time I'd heard a machine speak in the divide. The only machine with a voice. Why would I have brought it here? I've walked the east. You've walked the west. More than I have. Circle Junction, Reno, Vault City. Word of you at Fort Aradash. Fort Abandon. Even further west than that, Brahman drives on the big circle. Whatever you saw out there wasn't enough to make you stay. Maybe the markings on the package reminded you of the road home. I didn't understand how a package could have done this. You will. I'll show the Mojave, bear and bull, the way of it. How couriers can break nations. What happened here can happen again. You've already proved it. What you did in Ashton. The silo there. I had no idea the silo was active until the missile was in there to what hope you. Didn't stop you though. Like carrying the trip to Vegas. Old world death in your hand. Pieces of the old world like that just need someone careless enough to take them where they need to go. To do their killing. I'm not to blame for Ashton the chip or the divide. All these roads that you walked, these packages that you carried, think it wasn't your choice? Of course, it was your choice. You could have stayed in the Mojave, but you chose to come, couldn't let be, not in you to let go. Came for no other reason than you were curious, restless, always have been. Had to know the why of it. Now, I'll show you. The why of it? You're the one who needs to answer that. Why are you doing this? Want to hear the answer of it. Not just history's answer. Your answer for what happened here. So you're angry because I accidentally brought an explosive to the divide? Accident. Ignorance is a choice. The chip. A choice. As for anger. It is what I carry for the dead, and all that come here. The divide explosion, what? Did they kill your family, your wife, children? My family. My tribe lives. Its history. Died long ago. Fell under the shadow of the bull. Consumed by another symbol. No. This isn't about family. Or any common blood. It's blood shared by axe, not by chance. If you're leeching, are you angry because they destroyed the divide supply line instead of you? The supply line, the artery for the West. I have seen the blood of NCR at Legion hands many times. I carry no hatred for duty, if that's what this was. The divide 
was more than that. It's people more than that. If you blame me for what happened here at the Divine, why do you care? The community that was once here and the package you brought both had markings of the Divide, markings of America. You've seen the marks, the symbol, as early as the Hopeville silo, maybe. Carried it etched on your weapons. The Divide, its buildings, its people, were built around those same markings, surrounded them here. Markings like the flag on my back when I followed a yellow road to the Divide those years ago. I saw the symbol I wore all around me. An old world symbol, strong to survive here. Its people, strong. Outlast the bear, outlast the bull. Promise of something better. Kaiser was right to want it dead. NCR was right to want to rake their claws in it. Seeing it changed me. Just the seeing Hoover Dam changed Kaiser and the NCR. Seeing it end changed me too. So you believed in this place with once was? There was hope here. Another chance. A new nation stirring to life. A place I could have set my flag. Not the America of old, but something larger than the tribes of the East. Something larger than the houses of the West. Something better. The divide could have bridged both like Hoover Dam. Now like the dam, it's too covered in blood to see what it could have been. You gave life to this place. I followed a your road here, saw the divide. You led me here so that I could see. Then you brought it to an end. So this is arranged then for destroying the divide? My history isn't revenge or hate. The road that brought us both here isn't about that. It's about the message you carried. The one in that package, whether you knew it or not. The message that one can kill a nation, can kill a symbol, and all that gather beneath its flag. I don't blame you for the divide. I blame you for what you made me see. Now you will see what you brought to the Mojave, and that will be my message to you. I don't understand, what message? The nations of the Mojave, cracked and broken as the divide, its people the same. I have walked at Kaiser's command across the east into the west, far enough to know Kaiser's word did not drive me, far enough to see the end. You've seen it. No courier, whatever their flag, can ignore it. Why you didn't stay in the west, why you wondered. There's no future in the bear or bull. The bear is diseased, barely clings to life. And the bull, when the legion reaches the sea, it will turn on itself and die. Killing one will end both. And you made me see how one could do it. Your ignorance, carelessness, can be used with a purpose. Then you learned the wrong message. Really? Who's to say the truth of it? You? No. You walked from this, turned your back on it. Now you and others will answer for it. I'll start with the West. Let that burn. Then, if the East falters after, I'll bring 
bring the divine there as well. Burn away the flags. Begin again. You wanted me to come to the divide. I'm here. Now what? Your roads are not done. Haven't walked it full yet. Not nearly enough. The way ahead and below leads to the heart of the divide. And there, you and I, we'll have an ending to things. This canyon is miles long, maybe longer. Where can I find you? At the end of the divide, through the trenches and wreckage, that's where you'll find me. My new home, here, amongst dead men. You and that machine. Keep your eyes on the tower that cuts the horizon. You'll find your way. Made it this far. Not much farther to go. Alright, well, it's pitch fucking black. Like, holy fucking shit, I can't see anything. Anyway, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. All we got to do is not use this gun. Use this one instead. <laughs>